All right, guys, welcome back to another video. It's your man, Jay. So uh, the Galaxy Note 9 uh, is a device that has a 4,000 milliamp hour battery inside, but some people still require more battery. So I've reviewed a lot of zero limit cases and um, there's a, a zero limit case. This is the newer model. So, I mean, this is for the Galaxy Note 9. There's a couple of different versions of this out there, but this is the upgraded model of the zero limit case. And if you saw the other one, it's uh, got a bigger hole up here at the top, and it's the thicker version. It sticks out. It wedges out. It's a very bulky version of this. So Zero Lemon reached out to me and said, hey, Jay, you know, we got a better version of this case. You know, let me send it to you. So um, and there's, actually, there's actually three versions of the, a battery case for this phone. Now, there's two versions of this 5,000 milliamp one, but they also have a 10,000 milliamp hour battery case. And I think I'm going to love to get my hands on that one, too. But for now... This is the upgraded version of the 5,000 milliamp uh, hour battery case for the Galaxy Note 9. Now, I used this and I got a couple of cycles out of it already. Uh, and it's fully charged. Now, I charged it back up for the purposes of this video. Uh, but the case itself has a matte feel around the size where you're going to be holding it at. And then, um, you know, like all around this size, it's just, it's just matte all the way around. So you're going to have lots of grip with this thing. Um, now, you're probably saying, Jay, well, what was wrong with the other version? I don't think it was anything wrong with the other version. It just didn't wedge off at the top right here. You know what I'm saying? So it kind of had the design from previous battery cases. And this design right here gives like this sloping uh, curve, like a smiley face on this one instead of a square look. And this one also is a little bit more squared off to match the ergonomics of the phone. So... What I did was I tested this out, you know what I'm saying? And again, with zero limit cases, you get everything inside to instructions on how to do it. So if you lose the, lose the case, case and that it came in, you don't have to worry. Everything's printed inside the inside the battery case. Now, um, before I get going, this version of the case is on sale for thirty nine dollars uh, directly from Zero Lemon. You can check that out. I have a link in the description, and you'll also see the other cases that I'm talking about for the Galaxy Note Nine because you might like the other version, but. This is just the latest upgraded version uh, of this case. Uh, and I think they just changed something to do with the ergonomics of the case and make it easier to get on and off and things like that. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. But this definitely feels good. And uh, it's, it's, it's a nice case to hold, even though it's a big case. Cases like this, you need them for when you're going on trips and stuff like that. Or you might you might not want to you might be in a car or something like that. And, you know, you need to um, get get the. Uh, the life out of that when you can't just you can't just stop you know what i'm saying so um the the battery case itself fits on form fitting it's really nice uh it's it's not as heavy and bulky as you would think it is because when you think about it adding on a 5000 milliamp hour battery the phone is already kind of a lightweight not too heavy uh but it's heavy enough you know what I'm saying? it's a big phone uh, but this isn't going to make the phone any taller or any wider because it's basically just a battery sitting on the back but what you get with the included um, case is a little bit more grip and comfort. Now, I do have a um, white stone dome tempered glass. So if you guys are wondering if it will work, yes, it will work uh, with the white stone dome tempered glass. And it'll probably work with most tempered glasses that are case friendly. So keep that in mind when you decide to um, pick up a case uh for, uh, for, uh, pick up a case with the white stone dome glass or just any tempered glass you want to make sure it's kind of case friendly so uh but with that being said battery life how is the battery life so the the galaxy note 9 has a 4000 milliamp hour battery inside of the phone now without this case i mean i was able to pull down about six and a half hours of screen on time on a single charge and you know make it through a day make it through a work day um but with this case you definitely can go uh, about two days, probably depending on your usage. You can go even farther than that. Now, remember, I'm a pretty heavy user when it comes to snapping in and out of my phone. Now, you probably say, Jay, that's only six and a half hours, six to six and a half hours of use out of a 24 hour day. Well, when you're measuring screen on time, those are just the numbers that the total. But when you're using your phone, you're not using it six and a half hours straight through. You know, you're in and all out of your phone. But with a battery case like this and all these battery cases, here's the G7's battery case from Zero Lemon fantastic it, it does it really adds life to the g to the g7 because that has a 3000 milliamp hour battery inside uh but this adding this to the galaxy note 9 you pretty much have 9000 milliamps at your disposal so you'll be able to shoot video all you want you know what i'm saying you'll be able to 
stream longer, you know what I'm saying? The best way I think to use these cases is to power it on and let the case run out. I've seen some people uh, use these cases and they wait until the phone starts to die. But I would say in my testing, now I used to do that too, but I would say in, in my testing, I would tell you, let let it stay on and use it until the the case dies. So to power it on, you just hold it down. And if you want to check the battery, you just tap it once and then it'll flash the lights and let you know what's available. So right now you can see it's fully charged and then it's also charging the phone. So a, a battery case like this, yes, this isn't. Now, some people, now I will say this, some people can use this for like day-to-day -day use. They don't care, you know what I'm saying? That, um, but me, I normally would keep my phone inside of another case when I'm out and about. Uh, but a phone case like this is definitely good for like if you go into a game or you just, you know, you just, you know, you just need to have the, the extra battery power. So with the zero lemon cases, with this one, I just, it'll run and run and run until the, until the case dies. And this one right here, uh, I think you, I think I've had to turn this one back on. Uh, but some cases are, are defaulted like that. They'll shut off when you, when it gets to a hundred. Now, it, when the phone gets to 100 and you just turn it back on as is. But I would say keep using the case. I would say just if, 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 use don't let your phone die all the way down to uh, if the case doesn't stay on for you automatically and continues to charge your phone like a, let's, let's just say like a Moto battery pack. If it doesn't do that type of deal, let your phone run 20 percent, then hit the power button and get it back to 100 because you'll find that you're getting more out of the battery case instead of letting the phone run all the way down. And another thing, another reason I say that is because. When a phone is charging from a lower battery level, it's, char it's trying to charge really fast. And so the phone heats up. So my advice to you is to, you know, with this case, let your phone run to 80%, turn, it turn the case back on. You'll find that you're, it'll, it's going to appear, you're going to get the same battery life out of the case. But when you, when you run it like that and you have the battery dropping at 20% increments or 30%, whatever you choose, I just don't recommend that you run your phone all the way down and then turn this case on and want to have it charge your phone because the phone will heat up, the case will heat up because it's working really hard in those early stages. But in the later part of, uh, of, of a phone charging, the phone starts to trickle charge. Even on fast charging, it starts to trickle charge. And you want the phone to have a nice, um, cool to the touch feel. You want it to be... Um, a, a cool when when you when you're using it you don't want it to you don't want it to to be real hot you know what i'm saying so the case is fast charging pass through so what that means that you can plug in your charger your fast charger and charge the case and the phone now i've already demoed i've, I've already did i didn't demo it to you guys but i've already done that uh and it it works the pass through is is good so nfc is not supported with this case so if you do like um Use your Samsung Pay a lot. You got to take this case off to do so. They have a disclaimer in that due to the design, you can't use. And that's what most cases, you know, unless the NFC patch is way up at the top or something like that, you're not going to be able to use NFC with it. But the fast charging pass through is actually really good. The case actually charges the phone actually pretty good. It charges it pretty fast. So I just wanted to give you kind of an extended uh, walkthrough or, or talk about this case, because um, for those of you that like battery cases this definitely this newer grippier design for the note 9 some of you guys probably didn't even see the older design of this case uh, but it's on the website still so be sure to check that link in the description uh, and you'll see all the note 9 cases and things that you can get but uh this design is definitely way more ergonomic for this phone and it gives it the grip on the side so if you didn't want to use these these other cases like this and you just wanted to put a tempered glass on there and you're all about that battery life cases like this are perfect for you you know what I'm saying? You got tons of grip. So with that being said, man, I think this is a good look, man. I shout out, again, shout out to um to Zero Limmer for hooking up the 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 sponsorship for this video and hooking up the case. Basically just sending the case for review, and that's that's pretty much it. Um now you're wondering about the S Pen. You can get to the S Pen. It is deeply recessed. Uh, you know, the, all these are deeply recessed because this is kind of a protector case. So you, you're going to need to push down in there and you're going to need some kind of nail or something, uh, to, to get to get your S pen out, but you can get it out and it's all good. Yeah, there it is. So, um, I definitely will be careful with that S pen though, because I've heard the kind of fragile taking it in and out. Uh, but, you know, you can see the indicator light that is charging right there. 
and you know the battery you tap it and it shows you how much is left down there so you know this is kind of a uh, it's a win-win for people who definitely like battery cases i hope i covered everything for you you can't wireless charge with this case on obviously and again watch out for nfc if you do samsung pay just take it out of the case before you you know get it um get ready to pay for your stuff so taking it in and out is pretty simple getting it in was kind of kind of tough at first because you know i was trying to line up the usb type c port uh but once you get this on, you don't have to take it off if you don't want to because it has Type C on the bottom. So that's a huge plus. It doesn't come with any kind of cables or anything in the box because you just use your factory ones. So you can fast charge this and fast charge your phone, and you're good to go, man. So that's the Zero Lemon um, Galaxy Note upgraded version. Uh, and when you when you look on the website, look for Galaxy Note Nine battery case, five thousand milliamp upgraded. And you'll see this case. Look for that sloping curve design. And you'll see the other one on there. It's kind of squared off. You'll also see that 10,000 milliamp hour battery case. Really looking forward to trying to get my hands on that one too. So Zero Lemon, I appreciate you hooking up that one if you will. But it's your man Jay. Uh, leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.